My life was bleak, and I was trapped in it. I was disconnected from the world. I practically existed within myself, stuck in this dark room in the dull recesses of my mind, watching life go by but never fully engaging in it. And I was all alone. I felt so detached from people, I couldn't connect with them. Every conversation, I just felt distant, like I wasn't actually engaging in it, but watching some form of myself pretend. Every word was fake anyway, not just for me, but for everyone. There was no sincerity anywhere, nothing felt real. It was all the same every day. Wake up. Go to class. Go home. Eat dinner. Do homework. Go to bed. Repeat. It was the same damn thing every single day. It was monotony at its finest. The days were all starting to bleed together and I just floated right on through them. My life was on autopilot, but I don't even think you could call this life I wasn't even really living. Sometimes I wondered how it would be like if I just broke loose, did something spontaneous, so for once in my pathetic life I could feel free. But instead here I was, practically dead. It sounds silly, but sometimes I sit in the park and just watch the squirrels interact. They were so playful, so careless, so free. All the things I desperately wanted to be but never could. Sorry, didn't mean to scare you. It's just that you were kind of sitting there awkwardly, so I wanted to make sure that you were okay. I'd seen her before. She was one of those people you always see but never have talked to. Probably have come across her on Facebook too. You can't miss her. There's something so different about her. She's so happy, genuinely happy. And here I was, couldn't even get myself to smile sometimes and she does it so effortlessly. I didn't understand. I wanted to know her. I'm fine. It's just that the squirrels are so... I couldn't believe I was telling her this. Free. I know. Come on! I feel like if I just jumped, I'd finally feel free. Nothing holding me back. Until you hit the concrete. But I almost feel like it would be worth it, you know? If it ended after that, then, oh well. Not much to this life anyway. You never feel like this, huh? Hopeless, like there's no point. I just look up at the sky and I feel hope. I mean, look at it. So huge and limitless. All these possibilities and a purpose, you know? There's hope in the sky. There's hope? There's hope. I want that. You can have it. I didn't know if I really believed it. But in that moment, I felt something. It was small, but for the first time in a while, it was real. And just seeing her and hearing her, well, maybe there was hope. 